All right, gang. Now, a lot of people will probably ask, how did you learn a lot of these things? What kind of equipment? Gang, we got a lot of equipment here. And what I'm going to do is try to show you some of the equipment or as much as I possibly can. And we discovered many things by using x-ray. We had a, a medical doctor gave us a humongous x-ray machine, and we could actually x-ray the whole horse. But we discovered a lot of a lot of things, and a lot of medical doctors, bone specialists, come down here to Research Center, and they are really amazed some of the things we're finding out here at the Research Center. And every bit of this is to help keep our horses more sound. Now, we're not just studying sick horses down here. We're studying how to keep the horse sound, okay? Now, we have a special DVD that goes through taking care of the horse and taking care of the feet. Because most of your horses, gang, found her on grass, and we go through that. That's a special DVD, what you should do, how to take care of your horse's feet. And because we get hundreds of phone calls, and the reason I'm doing this TV show, gang, is we have so many phone calls here that we don't get around to answering some of them for months and months. And so I know your horse is important. I know your question is important, and I apologize, but we're only just a handful and we're more than happy to answer your question, but it's much easier to get a DVD. And, you, and that's the reason I'm going through a lot of these problems of stumbling, forging, overreaching, scalping, and so on, and even speed cutting. Because if your horse is doing any of those things, and here's another thing about the grammar school DVD. You can, it tells you how to tell one leg's longer than the other. It goes through a heck of a lot of things you can see with your own eyes. And I think that's one of the most important things we have done for the horse owner in years. But anyway, let's get back to some of the equipment. We, when we got into foundered horses, we've come a long way in foundered horses, and I think some of the discoveries we, discoveries we have made can really improve and help the horse owner. Okay, we used a hydraulic table because most of the horses that are brought in here couldn't hardly walk. And I'll show you what happens and the reason you need a DVD if you just bought a horse or you're planning on buying a horse, you need to understand more about the horse. It's easier to sit in front of the TV gang and uh, yeah, it's not going to always stand there and see a handsome guy like myself. You're going to be watching other things. But let's take a look at some horses that are brought in here. And you can see these horses can hardly walk. And we, we've tried different techniques, heart bar shoes. We've tried just about everything under the shining sun. I'm not the only apple here on the tree. Remember that. There's a lot of expert fairies in here that's helping do the research, and we have come a heck of a long ways, and we've learned a lot about laminitis. So I encourage you to get that. If you're buying a horse or you're going to purchase a horse, we have a special DVD you can order just for that. Now, those DVDs, gang, are not free. Remember that. Okay? Now, we're tickled to death. We've, been on, we've had a television show now for nine or ten years. And we really enjoyed coming into your home and talking about horses. And, you know, we love the horse, and I know you do too. I know you want to keep your horse sound. But here's the thing, gang. You need to take care of that failure. Remember, I have told this, and I've said it just about every show. The most important person to the overall health of the horse is that guy that's working on those feet, the failure. Remember that. So we lose a lot of failures, gang, by the horse owner trying to jew them down. Now, 10 years ago, we did a price, what it cost a farrier to shoe a horse, because a lot of people just think it's the nails and, and the shoes. But here's the thing, gang. He has to pay his own insurance. It's a very dangerous trade, and it's going to shock you. This was 10 or 11 years ago. It cost $41.50 for that farrier to shoe that horse. Anything above that is profit, if he pays for what he should, like his retirement plan. He needs a retirement plan like anybody else. So we lose a lot of great failures simply because we try to jew him down too low. Remember, he's the most important person to the overall health of the horse. I just want to bring that up. Now we have x-ray machines here. We've got hydraulic tables. We've tried everything. We even the little chainsaws that we use when we're working, we've experimented with those things. They're very small. And you can see there's just a shot of me using one. Great too, especially when you're trying to work, because you want to work real fast when you're working on laminitis anyway. Because the horse is sore and you want to do as less damage as you possibly can when you start pinching with those nippers, 
you know, when a horse is sore, he's just like me and you, you know, we've pinched around on, okay? Now, we've got uh, tracks, we have treadmills, we've got x-ray machine, and we've added a thermo imaging. And I, that really tells us a lot. And you can see here when we're testing horses, and that's where we started finding out a lot about the trim versus the shoeing. And a lot of these people that are teaching just trimming, now we have a special DVD to help you trim your horse. If you've got just a backyard horse for your children or somebody and they ride them once a week or something and you're just around in the yard and you can't afford a shoer, we understand that. We understand the reason we need cowboy shoers because a lot of people can't afford a, a big time shoer. But however, those feet needs to be taken care of. So we have a special DVD and there are about three or four of those. It takes you step by step from the horsemanship, how to get up on the horse, how to handle the horse, and to trim the horse. That's a special DVD just for you. Now it's gonna be a little hard work, you need help. You, those DVDs are really gonna help you gain. Hold those mules, pull them in, we're gonna be right back in just a minute. And this is really just important, gang, for I think people to, you know, we, we made this DVD the grammar school of trimming and shoeing for horse owners and farriers. Which anybody can get. Exactly. All they have to do is it's order free. it, it's free, they exactly. just have to pay postage and handling. And the purpose of that, and I don't know exactly what it is, is we have to pay people to package these things right. up, to go get them. It's it, like it's, everything, exactly. no matter what you order. So in reality, they're getting it free, but mm -hmm. they're paying for the handling, right. going getting it, putting it in a package. It is very important to know your grammar school, where you're going, because if you don't know where you're going, in reality, you're lost. Yeah. Hey, gang. 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 Welcome to Horseshoe and Time. Let's talk. That's the whole purpose of having a research center gang and a television show where we can actually research things because throughout history nobody has ever really researched farrier science and for the first time the farriers and the horse owners come together and built a research center wherein that they could investigate products, they could investigate new ways of shoeing to help protect and keep our horses healthy. We so tickle that you're watching the show and hey grab a horse on about all and twist him a little bit, bring him in and tell him about our show. Watch us next week on Horseshoe and Time and right after that, Horseshoe and Time, let's talk. And remember this gang, a happy horse. Makes a happy owner.